conversation. Yeah, sorry, I just totally forgot that I wasn't sorry. Hey, 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 glad you got your suit less than uh, 24 hours ago. That was super cool of you. Deeply appreciate it. And um, we're going to have fun and drink a lot, but not too much, hopefully, for you. And I don't know, it's just a big party. I'm excited. <laughs> That's all I got. I don't know. Love you. <laughs> hey, Krista. Can't wait to actually uh, marry you. Well, I guess ceremoniously since we're already married. Uh, but tonight's gonna be an amazing party. I hope you had a great time with all the bridesmaids. I can't wait to see you down there. Okay. Okay. Oh. You look amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin did a great job. Every day that I'm on this road, the challenges of unknowns are low. As I watched the fireworks over Seattle Space Needle ring in the new year, she came over to me, put her arm around me, and told me about her family. <laughs> that conversation alone has single-handedly paid for my therapist's yacht. <laughs> and unfortunately, I don't remember the first time I met Ben. But all of a sudden, this tall, drunk dork <laughs> that started hanging out with Krista. So we all assumed it was either love or the beginning of a true crime podcast. <laughs> and now we know it's love. I promise to be there for all the moments that life will bring us. The ones full of laughter and the ones full of tears. I promise to always support your dreams as you have always supported mine. I promise to listen and eat something when you say, I am hangry. Ben, you have been an absolute pain. I mean, um... <laughs> supportive partner <laughs> to me since the very beginning. We have seen our fair share of ups and downs since we met about five years ago. Biggest up probably literally being on top of Crystal Mountain. Biggest down is me probably not making it down Crystal Mountain. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Ben and Crystal Asanga. <laughs>
Ben wanted this speech to kind of feel like a roast, but I've known him so long, I just figured that's way too easy. You know what I mean? I could do that all day, stand up here and make fun of Ben. He used to cry. He'd cry when he lost at video games. His controller was always the broken one. Why was his controller always broke? We're still trying to figure that one out. It's always a different controller, but it's always broke. All jokes aside, though, um, I'm just so happy to see my best, friend, my best friend and my best man at my wedding has found a special someone that makes him feel stronger and happier than I have ever seen him. Growing up, Krista and I would fight like rabid animals. We had our first hug when I turned 20 years old, and all it took was for her to move 3,000 miles away in a true crime podcast for us to grow closer. We also realized we hated all the same people for all the same reasons, which is the truest human bond. I don't even remember if we were fighting necessarily at work this night, but I'm riding my bike home, and she thought it would be really funny. She still thinks it's funny. She's laughing now. To quote, love tap me with her car while I was riding my bike. Look at her, she's proud. <laughs> ben is terrified still. And finally, to the happy couple, may the best of your past be the worst of your future. And may Krista never love tap you with her car. And then just one more thing I want to show now. You take me way out. You take me way Hope we're not dead. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> and if we are, it's likely just me. Um, but hopefully, in the next five, ten years, we somehow survive the tortures of law school. Um, pop out a couple children, you know, <laughs> and really start our family. Yeah, that's all I got. I'm happy. Yeah. <laughs>